Stay one step ahead with Dubai Eye. Is there anything you can tell us that has already been discovered in in either of those processes about where architecture could have played a, a bigger role or things that we need to think about? Yeah, I mean, it, I mean, very clearly, anybody who saw footage of the Grenfell Tower fire will see that it spread very quickly across the surface of the building, the outside walls of the building. So clearly, a lot of the initial attention is focused on cladding. But there's probably more to the story than that. It's quite obvious that some of the internal compartmentation failed. This was a building with only one staircase, so there were lots of factors. Has it prompted a, a rethink of tower design? I think so. I think actually in the UK it's prompted a a total rethink of our approach to life safety in buildings actually. So uh, I think we're very much at the early stages. The RIBA has called for quite a bit of change and we're not quite sure how it's all going to play out. I think it's also flagged up that in an increasingly globalised construction industry, there's really a need for more international standards. Um, There's quite a lot of difference between different countries. And certainly in the UK, we've had some confusion over what I might call equivalency. You know, we have British standards and European norms and which ones applied. Stay one step ahead with Dubai Eye.